told you that I loved you every night Oh, that's on my mind I should've told you that I loved you One more time, one more time Would you have stayed if I had been Say it's okay if I'm falling and you're running away. Good morning everyone. Today is day 14 of quarantining. I will be officially leaving tonight. Yay! I don't even know what day it is anymore. I think it's a Friday. Today I woke up especially late. It's around 10 a.m. Excuse the rooster hair. Yesterday I finally finished translating 50, 50 pages of material for work. So I'm just gonna enjoy myself. Probably eat breakfast right now because it's already here, but I'm just too lazy to go get it. So today's just gonna be cleaning and packing and having fun okay guys so i just made myself some coffee i got my breakfast at the door and i found this little paper that they gave me so this is what they give you the day that you leave so i'm leaving tonight at 12 midnight so this is kind of our permission slip to leave this is my last breakfast of quarantine and i am not mad about it at all So good. When they give like pretty hearty breakfast like this every morning, I usually don't eat the whole thing. It's just too much. I, I, I don't really like having too much for breakfast. I think it depends what I eat, but I usually like fruits and like a toast or something. But when they give like rice and like full on like bulgogi or like chicken, I kind of save it for later. Today I'm just too excited over everything that I'm leaving. But I was way too excited cutting my apple with this. I guess it's good that's not focusing, but I literally cut through my skin and like you can see the chunk. Ah. At least the apple's good. So I am going to work out now. Last day of working out every day. I had one rest day, so I'm very proud of myself actually. Got my workout partner. Ready? Three, two, two. one, go. And with that, I have finished two weeks of working out. Ooh! I think overall, working out every day consistently was amazing. If you're gonna quarantine, I highly recommend you working out um, and making it a routine because I am like the type to really hate working out or really not really love it, but like if I'm in the routine, like I'll like do it. But it was so good for me mentally, emotionally, physically. Like I I definitely can feel myself stronger. Like I couldn't even do a push-up in the beginning. Now I can do like 16 push-ups with the same amount of time. Um, but yeah, this is a big thing for me because I can't do push-ups for my life. So Overall, totally recommend you working out, even if it's like not a, a very hard workout, like just keep your body moving. I think it's really good for your mental health. And another thing is make sure you do it with people. Uh, I mean, you don't have to, but like it's always really nice to keep you accountable to have someone to do it with. For me, I did it every day with my cousin. I think it was really good for the both of us to quarantine together virtually and work out virtually together. Highly recommend. Probably gonna go shower now and then pack. Lunch is here. I was gonna go shower, but lunch came, so. <laughs> and just like the past two weeks they've been giving out snacks here and there and I just haven't eaten them so I am carrying home a bag of snacks that they gave along the way that I never ate they gave a lot more than this but I obviously ate them all baby is for 30 my whole world is upset so it is 6 30 p.m. and 
my last meal in quarantine has arrived. Oh, how I will not miss this. But this is my last dinner here in quarantine or last meal here in quarantine. Honestly, I think overall the food wasn't too bad, but it also wasn't too great either. Last meal. So since I am leaving today, I am going to do my makeup because why not? I know I'm leaving at midnight and no one's literally going to see me, but it's the first day I'm out and I mean, why not? You know, just to celebrate. I just want to look presentable. Let's transform. Would you stay if I had been honest with you from the start? Don't say it. So that was my first time using this hair curler and that was hard. It's like a straightener and it has a curling side on the back, but it's a brush, so it makes everything like 10 times harder. So I feel like my curls are more voluminous, but that's only because it brushed it out well. Wow, I haven't glammed up like this in too long. Anyways, okay, I am gonna pack all my stuff, edit videos, post my video tonight, and yeah, just wait till quarantine ends. It's like 10 p.m. right now, I think. 